Ladies and gentlemen, we have a incoming message from Builderman, also known as the co-founder here of Roblox, David Bazuki. Now, I'm quite sure I'm saying his last name wrong, but the point here being is, in this video right now, I'm about to read off this little piece that he has written, just a general message to the Roblox community. He is showcasing that he cares deeply about what is going on here in the community and also outside of the community. So I'm going to read this over with you guys and I will also drop the link to this blog site so that way you guys can read it on your own as well. Now I do know that you are capable of reading it on your own but this is something that I like to do here on the channel so here we go. Drop a like on this video and subscribe if you're new. A message to the Roblox community. Dear Roblox employees and community members, it is a trying time for all of us right now. We have been through three months of battling a pandemic and enduring the many challenges of sheltering in place. Beneath the surface, people are struggling. 40 million Americans are out of work. There is a hidden toll on our collective mental health resulting from uncertainty the disruption of our daily routines and the tragic loss of thousands of lives. Now with the recent tragedy in my hometown of Minneapolis, we are faced with another occurrence of injustice against the black community. Many people in our country have justifiable lost faith in the American dream and the prospects of a fair society. For black Americans who have endured years of systematic injustice their loss of faith is sadly not new. We are seeing people speak up and take to the streets to demand equality. And many of us are grappling with what to do to make our world a more just and fair place. As I write this, the world seems upside down. And so I turn inward and reflect on the values that we embraced over 12 years ago when we founded Roblox. Respect the community. Put the needs of our community above our own. Take the long view. Incorporate our long-term goals in every decision. Get stuff done. Have a bias towards action. Self-organize. Act autonomously. <laughs> I said that wrong, um, but you guys can see it right here. Um, own it. Own the outcome for which you are responsible. Roblox employees in our community are working collectively to build a civil, just, and respectful online society. There is so much more we can do. I know we can find ways to bring people together, to learn, and to understand one another. My hope is that our community will take these learnings and experiences to the world outside and apply them towards good as they become the leaders of tomorrow. Please prioritize your self-care right now. If you need someone to talk to, please reach out to family, loved ones, and friends. If you are working at Roblox, you can also reach out to me, your manager, or your teammates. We are here to support you, David. So this was just perfectly written. Such a great message here. If you guys do not understand the message, then I don't know what else to tell you. You know what I'm saying? Because at this point, everything is self-explanatory. Now this right here, this is definitely going to be saved onto my bookmarks tab. This is something that I'm going to be reading every single day over and over and over. Because this is incredible right here. This is somebody in the Roblox community that took the time out of their day to write this article and to communicate with us. You know, this is amazing. This is this is inspiring. This almost makes me want to write a article and possibly submit it to Roblox or something like that. You know? But as he says in the wrapping up of this little piece, if you need someone to talk to, please reach out to your family, your loved ones, and also your friends. The same goes for you guys. This is why I tell you to comment on every video. 
This is why I tell you guys to join my Discord server so you can get to know me and I can get to know you guys on a personal level. You can message me any time of day. I will get back to you. I will respond to you. If you are in a troubling situation, you can let me know. We can talk about it. My thing about me is I'm a great listener. No matter what's going on in my life, I'm willing to listen to others and try to help them before I even think of considering to help myself. And you may say that seems a bit selfish, you know, but that's the person that I am. That's how I grew up. You know, so I want you guys to contact me whenever something is wrong. You are being bullied. You just need advice. You want somebody to talk to, you know, you're feeling lonely. Please message me. And also keep in contact with your family members because family matters no matter what. Your friends, they should be able to come secondary before your family. Now, I know a, a lot of people have family situations where we all become distant from one another, but still keep them within your circle. Don't let that slip away. With that being said, guys, I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.